All right, it's SoCal Rockhound here. I was asked to show what I do with some of my tumbler stones and just to show some of my tumble stones. So, so here's a big magnetic chalk board I got and I put magnets on the back of the, some of the ones I want to tumble and put up here for display. You can see right there. So anyway, so here's some of my, my tumblers. There's some really neat ones in here. When you look at these guys, there's moss agates. I got all kind of jaspers, green ones, red ones. I got some agates, some braciated stuff. Love these. Some more agates. That one's kind of neat. It looks like it has sutures on it. Let's see if I get close. There's some more aspects. You can see all the moss agates. Some nice moss agate. Right there. Let's see if I can get a better shot of it. That one right there. Really neat. There's a nice jasper, multicolor jasper. These are all from Lava. This one's cool because it's got uh, some little saginate up in there. Again, all different kinds. Here's some of the ones on the edges. I filled it up and I'm starting to go to the edges. So again, these are some of my better pieces. see the moss this one's cool this piece of moss right here it's got a hematite in it let's try to peel it off let's see hopefully we can get the hematite to show up there you go if you put it on an angle you can see the you can see the little metallic pieces hopefully you can see those little silver metallic pieces of hematite in there it's a really nice piece of moss right below it's some nice moss This nice flame moss right here. So I love this stuff. Here's some more moss here. Another big agate. Another agate with some inclusions. Another one there. Nice red orange jasper. And just overall, it's just one of the ways I display some of my agates. I put them all on a, uh, this magnetic board. Now then I have down here, Let's focus the light down here now. So down here I have some of my bigger pieces that I've tumbled and um, nice braciated right there. Big piece of braciated. Here's a nice big moss with some green on the top. This is a cool one. This one's kind of like purpley yellow. And here's another braciated. There's a nice moss right here. Check this one out. See what it looks like when you pick it up. Cut it and I did a little flat polish. Here's the golden moss. Get a nice picture of that. Here's some green jasper I found out there. We'll have to find more of this. Nice piece of jasper. This one's cool. Check it out. Most all of these I found last year. There's a big agate jasper. Oh, this one's cool. 
So this one's got hematite, so you can see all the hematite on this one. Check this side out. That hematite, is that cool? I got another piece of that right here. And here's a green jasper. With some red in it and stuff. It's a nodule. Let's move to the next level. Got some nice stuff down here too. So this one's actually my brother and I found this up in uh he lives up in Berkeley, California. This was actually called a Berkeley Blue Agate. So we were lucky enough to find one when I was just walking around. So there's all kind of neat stuff in here. Moss. You got lots of mosses in here. Nice orange brachiated. The blue here and here, that's actually slag. When I found it, just a little bit of blue was showing. I got all excited, but then I realized it was slag, but it polished up pretty nice. So there's something's ready. So here's a nice green and red jasper. Here's a nice one. There's a big, big piece of right here. Orange and black, yellow, red, all kind of colors in that piece of jasper. These two are really cool. These are moss. These are really cool moss ones right here. So you can see the pattern right here. This stuff is crazy. I love this stuff. The one next to it. Check this one out. Look at the green, the green moss on top. And then look at it on this side. Wow, huh? Isn't that cool? Orange, yellow, got the green in there. This is a cool one too. Nice cool moss, look at that pattern. And here's the back side. You can see when you find it, it doesn't terribly look much like the, like the front side. There's another one. Check this one out. It's a nice red flame moss pattern. Here's another moss one. This is why I love moss so much, if y'all can't tell. Here's another moss one. Check this one out. Nice green jasper. And it's all found in the same place. There's another moss. Check it out. Show as many as I can. Some pretty amazing stuff. This is a cool one. This is one of the videos I thought I had something with uh, green agate, but it turned out it's moss. These are cool. This one's cool because it's got green, yellow, and red moss. And then here's the actual slab piece that I didn't tumble. I don't think we should this one yet. Look at that one. See, it's got green, yellow, and red too. This one's just like a bluish green stone I found. I thought maybe it was turquoise or maybe opal. It's not. Here's a big green jasper nodule I found. Yeah, 
has that piece of slag glass. I know I've seen other people find them like up, up north in uh, like Minnesota, Wisconsin, up in those areas. They call it, sometimes they call it Leland Blue. So this would, it's not agate, it's actual slag glass. So I tumbled it. It had this stuff all over it. Only a little tiny piece of blue was sticking out. So I had no idea how it was going to come out when I tumbled it. Really nice red. Jasper agate mix. All right. This is a nice brushated right here. This is a good example of a brushated. Those patterns. All right, let's get down to the next level. Let's see what we got. My legs all stretched down that far. Um, I won't go as long as I did on the other ones. This is a really cool one here. Let's see if we get this one a little light. This is a nice piece of. Jasper and I tumbled this one in the big tumble. Came out, came out really nice. Oopsie. There's some other ones. Here's a little quartz plate I found out there. The only piece of quartz plate I ever found out there. Little tiny quartz. There's a calcite nodule. More moss agates. Lots of moss agates. That's why I love these things so much. This one was in one of my videos. I <laughs> had a shark. My brother gave me that shark. This one's cool. It's got druzy on it. It's another nice braciated. Here's a purple stone one of the, from one of the purple stones I had in one of my video. I tumbled it. This is one of the purple ones. Here's a blue one I found. I don't know if this is, uh, starts with a D deuter. I don't know how to say it, but anyway. It's blue. Found it out there. This is close to the Rastafarian <laughs> stones. And then down at the very bottom, which I know my light won't reach down here. Maybe it will. Some of my bigger ones. Let's sit down here. Okay. So here's some of the bigger ones. So you got bigger pieces of moss. Here's a big piece of moss. Check it out. Some beautiful stuff. Here's another big piece. Ooh, got some dust down here. Gotta get down here and dust. Here's a slice of a moss. Again, got some nice striped jaspers. Lots of different rocks. This one's kind of cool. This was in one of my videos. I don't remember which one. Well, most of these were in my videos. <laughs> Oops, dropped them. It's a nice big, braciated yellow. Another braciated with red and yellow. That's the only thing about these. Sometimes they have a lot of holes in these because of the way they form. There's red and yellow. So anyway, this is some of my collection that I have. So here's another. People ask what I do with these, all these big ones down here, I did tumble all these in my big tumbler. Oops, sorry guys. I did tumble all these in my big tumbler, so pretty neat. Just wanted to shoot a quick video.
because someone asked to see my collection. And again, this is all from last year. This was in one of the videos too, in the beginning of one of the videos, somebody commented on this one. So this is it all polished up. I think Keith commented on this one. So anyway, that's kind of it. Nice big boss. It's got a druzy. Anyway, thought y'all would like to see that. So, all right. I'll see y'all next time.